This is Rishi. Hello. And what do you do, Rishi? So I'm the uh, I'm a senior manager working for the Digital Home Group. So I'm the product manager for Logitech Review, and basically, you know, I work with the other product managers to create an ecosystem of applications and devices and controls around Logitech Review. This is his baby, basically. Yeah, my second baby. I already <laughs> oh, have one baby. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> well, yes. This is the probably lesser important baby, but very important to us. So. Um, we were talking a bit about how seamless this experience yeah. was, and I was hoping maybe we could get a little taste of it. Absolutely. So there's several levels of seamlessness, right? <laughs> so first of all, we talked about the seamlessness of access to content. So it's as simple as bringing up search and Whatever typing comes something. comes to mind. So I'm just going to yeah. type in content that I know exists on my DVR. So you can see immediately that there's a result from the web. So I have a YouTube video. I have results from a DVR, in case I have a dish box. I have results from live TV. Live TV. So it says it's airing today at 3 p.m. And, and if it was airing currently, it would say live now, right? So. I also have results from apps. So I actually have a top, a top gear clip in my local media somewhere. Yeah. I'm serving that up as well. So this is giving me seamless access to all of this content. And so, you know, great. So we've searched for this content, mm -hmm. but now I actually really want to tune to this. So in order to tune to this content, what I really want to be able to do is control my display, which is my TV, control the source of my content, whether it's the web or a set-top box. And I need to be able to control the sound, which is coming from my TV or, set, uh, or my audio video receiver. So let me tune so to... You can show this, Brian. So you can see that I'm tuning to, let's say, the web content. Yeah. And boom. I'm immediately mm -hmm. taken to a web page. Yeah. Immediately starts playing, and if I want to go full screen, so you see it's 360p. Mm -hmm. When I click on full screen, it actually bumps it up to 720p. Is so that better the resolution. Back feature? Uh, that's that's YouTube, yeah. So that's part of YouTube's suite of features that they've created to optimize your TV experience. And I hear that some websites also are optimized for the review experience. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah. So let me shut down this for a second. Fast cars. Yeah. So one of the things I want to show you is I can control my ADR, so I can control my volume. So for that, you know, to your seamlessness point, mm -hmm. I need to be able to control the sound that's coming through this. They want to be able to control web content. I can at least you know, click on this and stop it. So essentially, it's a Harmony remote in a keyboard. Yeah. And then to your other question around web optimized sites. So we have a few suggestions that we provide in under the spotlight section. It gives you access to TV optimized content. Literally, you can go to any website. You can do a Google search for TV optimized content. Mm -hmm. You can go to any of these websites. You can start playing with it. Wow, you can do a Google search right on the keyboard? Yeah, so what we were doing was essentially a Google search. Except that this Google search was not only providing you results from the web, it was also providing results from DVR, from your TV. So we tuned to a web result, which was coming from YouTube, but we can also tune to a DVR result. Okay. So, yeah, in a very simple and seamless fashion, you can see that we were in web mode, now we're in DVR mode. So that has everything that you're currently storing. In my DVR. I have started playing DVR content. Cool. And so if you're talking about, like, if you were to tune to a live TV result, so let's you know, that's a BBC program, if you want to see what's playing on BBC right now. I can search through my TV listings and immediately start playing live TV content as well. Oh, right. Do you want to play against extends. Kelly Rowland? Woo! Our game is ready can we turn it down? <laughs> yes. And this extends not only to content that you get from web, apps, TV, this extends to the personal realm as well. So, for example, if I'm looking for content from, let's say, ABBA, I get so one, of, one, of the, one, of the, one of the product managers on this product is an ABBA fan, so I've got ABBA content as a result of my home collection. And yes, yeah, so if you had collection on, the, yeah. on his network, it would also show ABBA. So you can see that I'm seeing web results, TV results, but I'm also getting results from my Logitech Media Player app. Yeah. So I select that result, boom, it gives me quick results. If I want even more results than these five results, wow. I can click in and get all of my results from ABBA. 
And of course, you can go slower than he's going right now. <laughs> he's on autopilot. Mm -hmm. So, um, and also he had talked about using, you can use video and your own vacation photos. You can just throw those right up on television, on your TV, from your network. So that's the beauty of it.